I pre-shuffled, so we're pretty much going to get on into the reading. Okay. Okay, for Aquarius, what does Aquarius need to know? Okay, someone's giving up. Um, someone feels like that, you know, they, they've been like the wounded warrior or they've had to... Oh, my goodness. Yes. Okay, it's kind of like they feel like, you know, they've had to stand back. And um, this is someone that um, it feels like, honestly, you, you may have not have given them the time of day. Or at some point, you know, they um, hurt you or they done something or something or another. Because um, it's, it's almost like that they're... They done something. They done something at some point in time that hurt you. Three of Swords. Um, and this could have been a ghosting or, you know, not putting in effort whenever you were putting in effort. Um, you see, you knew your worth and value, and they didn't know it, or they didn't show it. Um, so, you know, they're kind of keeping themselves stuck, and they're giving up. The death card, they're giving up. Now, I'm also getting that um, whoever I'm talking to now, now this could be totally different from this, um, and it's, it's so odd because this little message has been coming to me, and now it's coming to me strong. Um, someone is going to meet someone, and I get, um, I kept getting all in black. There is such a lack. So, this person may be dressed all in black. Um, yes, I'm, see, I'm seeing a, like a black suit, black, well, they're showing me black clothing. <laughs> they're showing, okay, this could, this could be for more than one person because they're showing me different clothing. They're showing me a dress. They're showing me a suit. Like I said, they're showing me pants, um, button-up shirt. So, someone's going to meet someone, or they're going to come across your path, or maybe they've already, in your, in your world, you know, and they're all in black. Um, it's almost like someone, um, feels a little hmm about the person but there's also that well maybe I should you know as far as giving them the time of day now it feels like that person uh, because I got such a lack it's almost like they could be very lazy or they could be someone who um, lacks something that will affect you in some way um, yeah, so that's for someone, but back to the reading. You see, this person, did they didn't know your worth and value. They treated you poorly at some point in time, or they talked to you poorly or something. Or they just kind of just turned their back on you and went their, their own way. Well, it feels like, you know, you know your worth and your value. And whatever this is, it ended. You know, you're done with it. You're not letting anyone mess with your world. That's what that feels like. Tell me more about this. They only want to give the minimal. They didn't want to give any emotion. Um, it was out of balance. They may have been, okay, they were double dealing. More than one person here involved. Possibly four they could have, yeah, they could have been dealing with, had you involved in like a um, third party, four party person. Um, it's like this person didn't want to give anything. They just clinged on to it. Didn't want to give nothing. 
And, you know, it's it's almost like you had to have the strength to get away from this because it it's like it kept you tied. It kept you kind of stuck there for a while. Yeah. Until you found the strength to cut yourself away from this, to end this, you know. It got too painful. And you've healed from it. You know, you know, you see this person as a player. And uh, you're not willing to carry that burden anymore. No. You know, um, Hangman is here because I feel like that uh, where you once bent for this person, you're no longer doing it. You're no longer uh, being flexible where this person's concerned. Um, it's like, if see, we get back to this same card right here. Now this is you. You're guarding yourself. Um, this person, it's almost like, no, stop. Don't come near me, you know. Um, this person, you don't welcome them to you. It's that type of feeling. Mm-hmm. Okay. 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 Aquarius. This is beautiful, though, because, see, you want more. You want more. You desire more, not less. See? You're guarding. You're, you're, you're standing your ground. You're not allowing anyone to uh, persuade or um, change what you want. You know what you want, and you're, you're not going to settle for less. So, whoever this is, they might as well forget it because... They broke your heart at some point in time or hurt your heart. And now, bam, you following your intuition. You ain't putting up with it. You ain't having nothing to do with it. And this is something that you move away from now. You move away from players. You won't want nothing to do with them. That's what I'm getting from that car. You know what you're looking for. And it's not this King of Cups. <laughs> Thank you, Spirit. It's not the King of Cups, which we had at the beginning. No, 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 no. You'll guard at all costs against this person. Mm -hmm. You're not going to allow them to uh, hurt you anymore. You make the decision. And I feel like, honestly, I feel like you're working very hard on what you need to work on. And some of that's you and, and uh, other, you know, abundance, stability. You're happy. But you've had to find the strength to get there. Manifesting what you want. That person was nothing but drama. Where you once may have felt like they were your wish come true. Wherein they were not. They, they brought negativity. They brought negative attachments. Um, there is a lot of passion here, it feels like. Um, it feels like for you that the passion has stopped, but the, the person's feeling passion. You may have felt passion at some point in time is what it feels like. And that is what I've got on that. Um, in the extended, I will just take some other cards. And, you know, we've got everyone here. I'll go ahead and tell you. Uh, you know, I see Capricorn. Um, I see Leo. I see Aquarius. Gemini. Gemini. 